No, don't adjust your sets. This isn't an actual mother giving birth, but it is an incredibly realistic simulator, and it's now the property of the University of Sunderland. The wonderfully titled Sim Mom is a life-size and lifelike mannequin, all the right anatomy in all the right places, a model that allows high-quality team training in rare emergencies that can occur during childbirth. President of Baby Life, James Drive, can explain slightly better than I can. Fortunately, emergencies are really unusual in the labour ward now. They still happen, you can't prevent all of them, but they are much less frequent than they used to be. So staff who are working in a labour ward get very little chance to actually uh, practice on the job, so to speak. So the idea here is that they'll uh, be able to learn how to deal with an emergency in a safe environment, and the model is brilliant because it can simulate everything. We've been a bit shocked to see it's breathing and it's got a pulse and everything, and anything that can go wrong can be made to go wrong on the, on the model, and, uh, and, and people can then learn how to deal with it. It still makes your heart beat a bit faster dealing with an emergency, even in here, but it does mean that you, nobody's going to be hurt if things, get, things are done wrong and need to be done again for the training purposes. It's amazingly uh, realistic because you've got the, the heartbeat monitor, you've got all the blood pressure and stuff that, that, that can be made to fall if somebody wants to train you on how to deal with shock they can make the blood pressure go down and it responds to the right treatment so it, it, it can it can really uh, the technology is mind-boggling as wondrous as the technology is though it's the benefit to the university that can't be understated sim mom is expected to play a key role in the development of the next generation of nurses and midwives and michael collins from the university is delighted with the fifty thousand dollar acquisition that's really, really important for the university. We've been spending a long time establishing links with the local trust with City Hospital Sunderland, and this is another step forward in that link. I, th I think the University of Sunderland as, a, as an institution has huge ambition, not just with um, what we're doing now, but with the, the view to the future has been um, incredible. Um, they're continually thinking about where we can be in five, not just in five, in ten years' time. And so that the investment that's being done now is preparing everything that we do for the future. So Sim Mom nicely ensconced, it should prove to be the next step in pushing the University of Sunderland further ahead at the medical competition in the North East. Andy Sixsmith, Made in Tyne and Weir, Sunderland.